don't let them deceive you. Having big tummy during pregnancy doesn't mean you have twins. I don't wanna go there. <laughs> well, let me tell you some ways you can increase your chances of having twins. In my previous video, I talked about in vitro fertilization. But if you don't like that one, one, there are some fertility medication they can give to you, like citrate and letrozole, which can increase the chances of you having twins. Well, it's just for 10%. Two is injectable gonadotropin. They're gonna inject you with that. Well, that one has the risk of you not just having twins. Maybe quadruplets or triplets. Uh, Three is about consuming some food or drugs that contain phytoestrogens. Phytoestrogen is like soy milk or maybe yam, but it has a very minimal effect. Also, women, if you just order for one trailer of yam, now they consume them every day. She, she. <laughs> If you know what happened. Then more importantly is about family history. You know, if your parents, your father specifically is a twin or they have twins inside their family, you have the chance of having twins too, naturally. Well, just have it in your mind that the most important thing is about genetics, you know, and culture. Because African is known to have high rate of twins. And if you desire a male child, have intercourse on the day of your ovulation or a day before. It is known that XY sperm cells swim faster than the XX. For a female child, have intercourse like five days before your ovulation period. The female sperm cells stay longer than that of the boys. There is likelihood of giving birth to a girl. All of these methods are not 100% safe. Have that in your mind. Just little, little research and science brought together. The major thing is your genetic and then the blessings of God. Check my page. You see a video on understanding the meaning of ovulation and then how to calculate your ovulation, whether you have a regular period or irregular period.